Welcome back to Iron Fury Plays Pokemon Crystal Randomized Nuzlocke. Last time we started the actual Nuzlocke part of our adventure and we ran into some encounters, some good, some bad, and we had a couple fuck ups, but it is what it is. Anyway, let's take a look at the team. Now, as you can see, I did grind everybody up to level 10 uh, because that's a good level for this point of the game. Anyway, we have our starter, Shelly the Kabuto, which is a rock water type, and it has Ancient Power Bubble Beam. It learned Feign Attack while I was grinding, and I figured I'd get rid of Hydro Pump because while it is a very powerful move, it's also very inaccurate, and I didn't want to leave that kind of chance uh, because that can cost us a lot. So I figured I would get rid of it. Bubble Beam is uh, 60 base power, which for this point in the game is still very good, so I'm perfectly fine with that change. Anyway, uh, I got rid of the pink bow on it as well because I gave it to our next Pokemon, the Snorlax, or the Godfather, who has Vice Grip, Mega Kick, Hidden Power, and Sacred Fire. Didn't learn any moves yet, but my god, look at those stats. Its speed is kind of low, but man, that attack stat and special defense. Woo! Anyway, before I get started, um, we have a few encounters we can get today, but I am broke broke. So I'm going to face some trainers, hopefully get some money, and maybe we'll start the gym first today, because uh, we can go into Dark Cave, we can go into Bellsprout Tower, we can go to, I think, Route 35, which is just past Violet City. What do you got to say? I caught a bunch of Pokemon, let me battle you. Okay, what do you... Preschooler Cammy. Okay. Send out a polywag. Well, I can take out a polywag. You know what? Let's let's just headbutt you. God damn! Shelly ain't taking no shit from a goddamn polywag. A dragon air. That's ancient power. It's level three. It should still die. God damn! Shelly is just taking lives. A golbat. Shelly is just. Come on, Shelly. God damn! A Pidgeot! Oh, I, I think I know what we're gonna do here. Well, you, uh, you got fucked pretty royally. Now. I don't think there's any more items for us to get here. No. So, I think I'm gonna go heal up just to restore my PP. And, yeah, let's see what we can take on the gym first. But before we do, is there anything going on here? I think this is a trade. Do I have a Diglett for my late- oh, God, no. God, no. Ugh, oh, fuck you. No, that is a terrible trade. Anyway. Because I don't think I have enough to even buy a Pokeball. I, I have enough for one Pokeball. Yeah, so we're going to do some battling first. Try and, uh... Try and get some money, and then we'll go and get our encounters. We should be fine. Level 10 is a perfectly sufficient level, so... Let me see if you're good enough to face Faulkner. I'm pretty sure I am. He's only the first... I mean, well, but unless you've got, like, a Mewtwo or something. Miltank! Level 9 Miltank. See, so, yeah, we're about on par. Um... Your defense is good. Your special defense is pretty good, too. But, um... I'm gonna Bubble Beam. As Hydro Pump. Miltank's special attack is garbage, though. I ran a Miltank for a while, and uh, it's definitely more of a physical attacker. Let's see how much Ancient Power does. This will hurt a little bit, though, only because it's... Yeah, but we ate it up just fine. But since it's part Rock type, it's not resistant to Hydro Pump anymore. So... As long as you don't crit, you should be good. Oh! 
I just had to say something! Ah! Get that level low! Oh, God! Note to self! Stop speaking! Holy shit! Oh yeah, what do you have to say? Hi! I'm not trying to, but I can give you some advice! Believe me! If you believe a championship dream, you can come true! You believe? Then listen! The last time is winning against the flying kite! Get into mine! Okay. I, I don't know what that voice was. The key word is guts. Those here are training night and day to become bird Pokemon masters. Come on! Um, for the record, and bird type Pokemon don't exist. So, yeah. Oh, a deli bird! Well, I have something just for you. Ice flying? Good but Oh god, it was a crit Shelly! That poor Della bird just got sent to another dimension! God damn! Oh, Bulbasaur, you know what? I think it's time to bring out my godfather. This poor Bulbasaur. You know, you just wanted to have a good day, but you want him pissed off the godfather. So have some sacred fire. Fucking murdered. Okay, let's put the Godfather in the front. Okay. Let's save here. Because, uh... Saving the game is good. I'm not gonna steal people's catchphrases. Nappy. Okay. I gotta I gotta get into my voice for him. I always kinda picture Faulkner to have like a surfer voice, so it's like, Brah, I'm Faulkner, the violent Pokemon gym leader, brah. People say it can clip flying type Pokemon wings with a jolt of electricity, brah. I won't allow such insults to bird Pokemon. I'll show you the real power of the magnificent bird Pokemon, bra. Never mind that shit, here comes Mongo. Rocker Donna! <laughs> oh my god. You sent out a fucking Menopod? I almost said Menopause. There is your new nickname for Metapod, ladies and gentlemen. Anyway. What? There we go. Fucking destroy this thing. Destroy this Metapod. Send him away. And Apom. Nah, we're good. Let's mega kick it. Is this thing... It's glowing. It's gonna use Sky Attack, but it ain't gonna live. No, you ain't take. Oh yeah, get get the fucking stepping. Get the fucking stepping. Darn, my dad's cherished bird Pokemon. All right, take this. It's the official Pokemon League Zephyr badge. You got nine hundred dollars. There we go. A little money. Got the Zephyr badge. Zephyr Badge raises the attack power of a Pokemon. It also enables Pokemon to use Flash if they have it. Anytime. Yeah, take this too. TM31. Okay, what do we get? They put TM31. By using a TM, a Pokemon will instantly learn a new move. Think before you act. A TM can be used only once. Contains Razor Wind. Oh, Razor Wind is, uh, shit, actually. It's a two-turn move. It is a normal-type move, so Snorlax, if it could learn it, because I did randomize DMs by typing. Hello, Dave. We discovered something about the egg. My assistant is at the Pokemon Center in Violet City. Could you talk to him? Okay, so yeah. 
I did um I did randomize who can learn TMs, but I did say uh, preferred same typing. So if Snorlax can learn Razor Wind, it would be a strong move, but it's also a two-turn move. And in a Nuzlocke, that can cost you. So anyway, let's go to the Pokemon Center because we have the aid there, but I'm going to heal up first. Oh, Davey, it's a long time, no see. Professor Elm asked me to find you. He has another favor to ask. Well, you take this Pokemon egg. We received the egg. Now, this is also going to be randomized, so... Who knows what the fuck it'll be? Hatches Hill grows into the egg, and it also has to be with other active Pokemon to hatch. Dave, you're the uh, only other person we can rely on. Please call Professor Realm when that egg hatches. Okay, now get out. Uh, let's take a look at the egg, because it should tell us when it's going to hatch. wonder what's inside. It needs more time, though. Well, hopefully whatever it is, it's a good Pokemon. Could be anything, though. Okay, so, we did that. Now let's go and get some Pokeballs. That's the only thing I am interested in getting. Um, we can get seven. Okay, so, we have a few encounters we gotta go get. I'm gonna heal up again just because I am paranoid as a motherfucker. Okay. Our first encounter is going to be a dark cave. What the hell am I gonna find here? Come on. A Persian! I can't touch this thing. Shit. Um... Yeah, Snorlax is gonna body this fucking thing. And while Persian is okay... I mean, I should catch this just for the box. Fuck, I can't... Hmm... I just have to hope Hidden Power doesn't body it. It's my weakest move... in general. Don't body it, don't body it. Shit. Ah, you fucker. Oh well. I couldn't do anything about that. I could've caught a Pidgeotto. Let's see what else I could've got. Ah! I never would've caught it anyway, but... Ah, oh, that hurts. That hurts. Oh, that that hurts. Okay. Well, our next encounter is uh, which round is this? Round thirty-six. Okay. Cause we can catch sun over here. A skip loom. Um... I'm just gonna... It has Razor Leaf already, so that's good. Don't buy it. Fuck off. It, uh, it's Hidden Power Fire, I guess. No, fuck it. That's another encounter lost. What the fuck? This is gonna end up being a... Anyway, we're here now. Fuck it. Our encounter for Bellsprout Tower is... A Wigglytuff. Okay, then. A lot of fucking normal types. I don't even... Am I just gonna buy this thing? Holy shit, you lived! Well, maybe you'll fucking join the team. Not, no. I'm not wasting that many Pokeballs for a fucking Wigglytuff. I'm sorry, but... I'm giving up all these encounters, I know, but... At the same time, it's just... I'm not... I... I only have two Pokeballs left. I can't be wasting it on a Wigglytuff. So... Uh, 
I, I, I don't even care anymore. You got a Doug Trio, I'm gonna Mega Kick you. A Celebi? Of course it missed. Of course it missed. Of course it missed! Of course it missed! Fuck you! Get out of here! Die! I don't... Oh my god. Holy shit. I don't even want to fucking read your dialogue. You're an asshole. What's this? Fresh water! Ooh! Another good item. I think it does, uh... About as much as the soda pop does, or at least it does 50. I know that. We stand on guard at this tower. Here we express our gratitude to honor all Pokemon. Fuck you. What do you got? A Fampy? You're good people. But unfortunately, Fampy had to die. Why? I can't. I can't. Kill it! Fucking kill this primate! Please! Whoo! I know primate doesn't have a lot of defenses, but I can't risk this thing having, like, cross chop or something. That is definitely hidden power fire. Which is good to know. Anyway. Um... Sway like leaves in the wind. Yeah, fuck off. Lady Antoinette. Oh, look at that! The Godfather can't fucking touch it! Uh, try it, Vice Grip. It might still do a lot of damage. It still might one-shot, because goddamn the Godfather's attack stat doesn't give a shit about typing. A Togepi? Oh, I'm... I'm sorry. I'm so sorry for what's about to happen. That egg just got scrambled. Goodbye. Yes, you are. The Godfather is just too fucking strong for you. Oh. It's sudden chugging. And we got an encounter. What the hell are you? A Magby! Ah, oh, I would have loved a Magby! Magmar's pretty dope. Okay. Let's do a little, uh... What does the mint berry do? A self-awakening for sleep. Oh, that's chesto berry. Okay. Oh, it's, yeah, super... That's like a super potion. Um... Yeah, that should be enough. I just want enough to... Okay. Let's see how we do. I train to find enlightenment in the Pokemon. Yeah, fuck off. Nobody cares. Nobody cares about your little goddamn sense of enlightenment. Sounds like entitlement. You have an Espeon! What the fuck? Not that I'm really scared, because, you know... Snorlax has a special wall, and goddamn, that... Espeon got fucking bodied. God damn. The Elder's HM lights even the yeah, he's giving us flash. Great. Great. Skip loom. Well we just bodied a potential partner before Really? Are we really doing this right now? <sighs> Fuck you. 
It has pedal dance! Oh, we'll eat this up, because we're... Oh, oh my god! Oh my god! The Godfather don't give a shit about your pedal dance! Oh my... That was a crit? Poof be gone! Poof be gone! Get the fuck out of here! Holy shit! A bald joke. Okay, whatever. Let me see how much you trust your Pokemon. I... I trust my Pokemon quite a bit. Especially when they're fucking powerhouses like the Godfather. A Pidgeotto! We're about to fucking rip its head off and stuff this bird. It has fly right. No, it's glowing! It's got fucking sky attack! That's actually kinda scary! Thank God the Godfather is such a monster and doesn't give a fuck! You have a Steelix?! Thank God we got Hidden Power Fire. God damn. It has growth?! Now thank God growth isn't like it is in uh, Gen 6 and Gen 7 where it raises both attack and special attack, because that would actually be kind of scary. But the Godfather's now level 13. Is he gonna learn to move? No. Okay, that's fine. Alright, let's put Shelly in the front. I'm probably gonna regret this decision, but let's put Shelly in the front. Oh. This douche. You are indeed skilled as a trainer. As promised, he is your HM. But let me say this. You should treat your Pokemon better. That way your battle is far too harsh. Pokemon are not tools of four. Huh. He claims to be the Elder, but he's weak. He stands to reason that I'd never lose to fools who babble about being nice to Pokemon. I only care about strong Pokemon that can win. I really couldn't care less about weak Pokemon. Oh, steps on left using the escape rope because he's a fucking bitch. We got a heavy ball. Remember that if we ever run into any kind of Steelixes or anything. Anyway, I'm going to save here. Because that is a good idea. And let's talk to you. So good of you to come here. Sprout Tower is a place of training. People and Pokemon test their bonds to build a bright future together. I am the final test. Allow me to check the ties between your Pokemon and you. Okay. I swear to God, if you have like a fucking Celebi or, or a Meganium or something, I am going to... You have a Hitmonlee! God damn it! What the fuck? My God. I am actually legit terrified. This won't kill either. Shelly's special attack is not as good. Ah! Oh, thank god that move has such shit accuracy! Holy shit! Get out! Get out! Oh my god! And a Graveler. Oh, I could body Graveler! Although, if this thing doesn't die... And it uses Earthquake... Oh, thank god. You're, you're dying. You have a special defense of a wet napkin, and... Get out. Get out! A Fero! I could body a Fero. A Fero with Arrow Blast! Of course you gotta crit. Get out! Get the fuck out! You lived. And you have Body Slam. Yo, that Fero's got a good move. What the fuck? Get out! I was just about to praise your fucking moveset. You're a well-trained Fero, and I would love to have a Fero on the squad. But, fuck off. Get out. Ah, excellent. You and your Pokemon should have no problem using this move. Take this Flash HM. Yeah, we got Flash. Good for you. I don't... Fuck off. I don't... 
fuck off. We could have got a Clefable? Run. Run. Godfather, help. Godfather, help. We're putting the Godfather in the front because there's fucking Parasect in here, and normally I am not afraid of Parasect, but uh, in this instance, yeah, we gotta run. We gotta fucking get out of here. Get out of this fucking shit show place. You know what? I, I'm a fool for doing this, but I need to know what that item is. Cleanse tag. Okay. Whatever. I don't, I don't care anymore. We gotta... Fucking leave. I don't. Okay. Well! That was quite the episode. We lost a bunch of encounters, but we did get an egg. And we did beat Faulkner and Sprout Tower. So I think that is actually a good place to stop. So next time, we'll make our way around to get more encounters for one. And hopefully not screw it up. And maybe make our way towards Azalea Town. So, until next time, take care.